This is my uh, latest poem and um, it actually started when um, someone was talking to me about, um, you know, God will provide you with a spouse. And I just thought, oh no, not this again. And before I knew it, I started writing this poem. So here goes, it's called Stop the Nonsense. This nonsense that people talk about just wants to make me scream and shout. Who told you that God will provide you with a spouse? Who told you that he will provide you with a house? I'm tired of it. I'm sick of it. Every day is a battle. All these lukewarm Christians telling lies, leading people like cattle. We have been put here to decide who we're going to serve. This life is about choice. That's why we have been put here on earth. Jesus drew a line in the sand. For all who believe in him, read John 15, then read John 3.16. A decision that every human has to make. So do you think God is going to provide you with a mate? God gave us choice. That's how it was. Stop the lies and stop the nonsense. Adam watched Eve eat the fruit. Many blame Eve, typical, but it wasn't her fault. You see, the deal was broken. Just read Hosea 6.7. Yeah, read all about it. Eve ate the fruit, but it's clear the covenant was broken because of Adam. You see, the blame game will go on forever, but the scriptures have constantly been manipulated because those who have an ear to hear knows that the word has also been annihilated. Yeah, Eve was deceived. Everyone knows that. But Adam should have spoken to the Lord. He knew the words of the covenant. I'm not angry. I'm not even upset. But you have to stop this foolishness. God is only interested in your salvation, not a spouse. That's just nonsense. God gave us choice and made us in his image. He gave us freedom. So get with it. Stop preaching false doctrine and all of these lies that God will give you lots of blessings, a husband and a wife. Come on, this is stupidity. You see, why would the Lord give you a spouse full of iniquity? We are sinners. He can't choose for us. He just shows us the heart. Too many of you being over-righteous. So sadly, the first humans made the wrong choice and many of us have gotten married and many divorced. So is that God's fault or is it yours? Are you therefore telling me that God made a mistake because you said that God shows your mate? Come on, this is foolishness. God will reveal the heart. He will not choose your spouse for you. That's just a farce. I'll say it again. God's interest in us is about our salvation. The Bible is all about being reconciled back to him. Quit the nonsense. Quit the stupidity. Get yourself a job and start earning your money.